because as a child, my way of dealing with yelling and criticism was to always have a response. As I reflect back on those I'm aware that I could have come off as a very privileged white woman. However, I don't want that to define who I am because I'm much more than that. I'm a wife, I'm a mother, I'm a teacher. So how about if I say this? Yes. I understand the perception that's given by the video is that there's this white woman who is berating and disrespecting and disregarding a, a male of color who simply just wanted to park in front of my house. I take full responsibility for that. I had an incredibly human moment that I'm not proud of and I regret. I'm also aware that that's not who I am, but there's so many other parts of me. The teacher, the healer, the psychologist, the mother, the wife, all of those are parts of me and a belief in equality for everyone and especially justice. And my second half of my life has been devoted to that in ways that I never imagined. Leslie Franklin, born 1960s Inglewood, California. Irish Scottish heritage. Raised in Rolling Hills Estates. Family's core values were advanced education and material success. Father was ambitious but lacked the dollar to pursue dreams. Mother was smart and resourceful but deeply unhappy. Father grew up partially on the edge of a Native American reservation. Father goes to military during World War II. He comes back with opt to play baseball for Yankees but loses due to family issues. Children feel the pain of parents' disappointments. Leslie feels the world is better than her childhood experiences. She sought to escape mom's unhappiness through academia. In school, music and athletics. Aunt Amp, uncle are hearing impaired. They have two children that come to live in her home. Leslie has first experience with discrimination. Her parents want her to date only within her race. She rejects this notion at a very young age.